check, mic check, mic check, mic check. Oh man, we are back in action. Fresh off the holiday too. What's up with my people, man? Fire Squad was popping. Make sure you drop where you from when you stroll in here. Shout out to my people, man. What's up with my people, man? We back with another news top five. Welcome, Seattle, Washington. I see you. I see you, Ohio, I see you. Let's go, man, we back. As Soon as we hit 250 likes, we are gonna go ahead and get it popping, man. Greetings from Turkey, how are you? Hopefully y'all enjoyed y'all holiday if y'all celebrated or not, you know what I'm saying? You know, some people celebrate it, some people don't. You know, to each his own. But we back with another one. We got another Nuke Stop 5, salute the Nuke, man. The original video will be in the description. You know also don't forget the merch just dropped come on man come on man this is for my real ones though only for my real ones though zambia what's up only for my real ones though india what's up so check it out use the code squad you get 15 percent off all my merch whatever it is it could be this it could be the appreciate time appreciate life it could be the health is wealth is you know Get it for the holidays, man. 15% off, you already know, man. Gotta look out for my people. UK was popping. Ohio was popping. Hey, I need y'all to pay real, real close attention. Because 2023 gonna be... We ain't even gonna get there. We ain't even gonna get there. We gonna stay in the present. Appreciate time. Appreciate life, which is right now. Florida, what's up? But as soon as we hit 250 likes, we gonna start the video. We got a top 10 scary ghost videos that went viral. Like I said, share this with one of your friends, man. The last person you text, just shoot it over to him, even if it was your mama. You know what I'm saying? LA, what's up? Shoot it over to mom, dudes. Be like, hey, ma, check this out. It's one of my favorite YouTubers. You know we're going to have a good time tonight. Brazil, what's going on? Canada, what's going on? Bama, what's going on? <sighs> Hopefully, we got a good one tonight. Shout out to North Carolina in the building, Mississippi in the building, the Philippines in the building. I'm waiting on y'all. I'm waiting on y'all. As soon as we hit 250 likes, we're gonna get it started. So I'm 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 waiting on y'all. You know what I'm saying? We got enough people in here to get that done. It should be simple. We should be in the video right now, actually. But you know, some people like to come in and just, you know, look around for a minute. Trinidad, what's up? Um, but like I said, this is for my real ones. This is for my real ones. Illinois was popping. Hold on, I think I got a super chat. Please react to Bizarre Bub Scary Videos. Maybe y'all check that out. I never heard of them before. You know what I'm saying? Colorado in the building. Make sure if you're in the rebroadcast, drop where you from. I like seeing where you from. You know what I'm saying? Definitely represent where you from. Hawaii, what's up? I love Hawaii. I got a vlog out when I went to Hawaii. That was beautiful. Black sand beaches. But anyway, if you're watching with your family, welcome. There might be a little bit of, you know, language that might be a little bit of a uh, vulgarity uh but yeah we're gonna have a good time tonight missouri what's up i'm waiting on y'all we close to 250 likes boom we hit it all right cool so we got top 10 scary ghost videos that went viral shout out to nuke man let me go ahead and pull this up for my people boom make sure i'm in the camera because you know you got to see my face you know also appreciate everybody um, with the super chats if you want to donate go ahead and donate i appreciate that you know what i'm saying all the people that's giving super chats if i miss it blame it on my head not my heart i definitely appreciate you but we got top 10 scary ghost videos that went viral if you with me i need you to drive with you in the chat if you with me i need you to drive with you in the chat we're gonna get it popping make sure you got your water too Make sure you got your water too. Let's get it. Walk without rhythm. Walk without One rhythm. One night, couple Eric and Dunya head out to the beach in the Netherlands. They plan to search for the bioluminescent algae that only appears during warm summer nights. The algae is a favorite amongst photographers and sightseers because of its oh, otherworldly blue sparkle as it crashes into the ocean waves. That's fire. Now, unfortunately, Eric and Dunya don't find any of the algae while strolling along the beach, and okay. they decide to just head back home. 
They stroll along a pathway that is surrounded by the overgrown brush of what is referred to in the Netherlands as the dunes. Okay. Without even knowing, Eric captures something that is downright chilling. What happened? It's well nice out here. Hold on, did you see that black shit? make your head explode again. While panning the camera, a dark Right here, right here, what is that? What is that? Hold on, let me. He gonna talk about Shadow like mask can be seen popping up there you go. and then quickly ducking back down into the brush. Appreciate that super it chat too. so quick that the couple doesn't even notice. I seen it. Now it's worth mentioning that the fence you see in the video is there for a reason as it's highly illegal to cross the fence and walk into the dunes. Uh -huh. These particular dunes are an important protected natural habitat for rare bird species that nest there during summer months. Shout out to Argentina. So it is highly unlikely that anyone could have been hiding in the bushes and there are no large animals in the dunes. <laughs> Y'all saying that's Takuchi? Now, this is when things start to get really weird. Okay. What is your hair? I don't know. Like Hold on, some button. Don't say that. I don't. Know. We're way too far away from any people to be getting creeped out over this kind of shit right now. I keep it to myself next time. Yeah, please do. <laughs> okay. <laughs> No, but are you serious? Did you really hear something? Yeah, what really happened? But something. what did it sound like? I don't know, like something like crawling? Something but crawling. Following. It's a bit weird. It's like, yeah, crawling but following. Is she felt like something was crawling and following No, it stopped her. because we stopped. So if we, we keep on going, it's going to keep on following us. <laughs> if we keep on... I don't know, I don't hear it anymore. Yeah, I heard it. Again? She's still yeah. hearing it. Oh shit, hello. There's nothing here though, babe. Maybe there's a, like a funny I gotta thing. back up. You know I gotta back up. She be jumping out in these videos. I ain't trying to flip back in this chair and, and, and you know, I gotta protect myself. Overly friendly bunny. Danya swears that she hears something following along after them from somewhere within the thick brush of the dunes. Shout out so to the just truckers what too, man. Is this? I don't know what that is. And even creepier is it following them as they hurry home. Real or fake on that one. Let me know what you think. I don't know about the that. night visitor. An overnight security guard is watching the basement lobby of a luxurious apartment building in Santa Marta, Colombia. Uh oh. At around 3 a.m., an old woman approaches the door, and the guard hurries over to open it up for her. Okay. The old lady asks for help, and it seems like the guard and the elderly woman are having a long conversation. Uh huh. One problem, though, there is no. Appreciate that super chat. Old lady. What? The CCTV cameras do not record any. He talking to somebody, then they said it ain't an old lady. What? Anyone else in this room. As his fellow guards watch him on the CCTV monitor from the control room, what? they start to get a bit concerned. So they radio him and ask, uh, hey, uh, well, what's going on down there? The guard says, uh, I'm talking to an old lady who says she needs some help. What? But the guard's blood runs cold as multiple replies come back on his radio from his fellow guards who say, there's no one there. There's no one there with me. What? The guard seems shocked, so they repeat, there is no one there. There is no one there. What? The guard is shook. He smashes at the elevator button in an irrational panic. And he then just makes out. a run from the building. He ran out. When investigating the case later, residents of the apartment say that they have also witnessed the spirit of the old lady. Hell no. Some nah. say they have also had conversations with her where she asks for help. Wow. So what do you think is going on here? Did he the security did. guard really see a ghost? Hey, they told him that shit. He said, <laughs> He said, hold on, I'm sitting here talking to a lady and I ain't really talking to a lady. I'm sitting here having a full conversation with somebody I ain't having a full conversation with. He said, I'm out. I leave it up to you to decide. Poltergeist. That was funny. A happy family in North Wales says that they live in a house that is over 300 years old. Damn. And is haunted by some sort of entity or poltergeist. 300 years? They say years? that they often experience unexplained activity 
So they decided to set up a security camera in an attempt to catch some of these strange phenomena on video. Uh oh. They upload their spooky captures to their YouTube channel, Ragnar and the Viking Family. Uh oh. So, early one evening after dinner, one of the kids is sitting at the dining room table with their laptop when this happens. Uh oh. We're talking about kids again and animals. You know what the. Hold up. 300 year old house. Somebody. Anyway, I'll be time for bed, do the bed. Okay. I'm going to go for a quick shower. Okay. Okay, and um, just shower if you need anything. Okay. We love you. Love you. Whoa. Whoa, the chair just moved? Whoa. Oh, shit. The Two separate chairs inexplicably move by themselves, one of them tipping over and falling to the floor. Uh -uh. The girl quickly puts down her headset and hurries to find her dad. But said, uh -uh. that's not all. What? Less than an hour later on the same night, this happens. I don't see nothing. A oh, cup suddenly flies the off the dining room table, spooking the family dog. Oh. Cut to another day, and the family dad begins to hear strange noises coming from the back of the house. The back? Fearing the worst, he grabs his phone and records as he goes to investigate. He said fearing the worst, he grabbed his phone. I thought he was going to say fearing the worst, he grabbed his gun or something, you know what I'm saying? Or something like fear, he's, he's fearing the worst. You know, if you're fearing the worst, you don't, I don't know, let's go. Gate. What happens next is downright chilling. A noise from downstairs sounded like footsteps. I came from the back of the house, and we know we're the only people in the house. Oh, shit. There's no one else here. It's daytime, too. I'm gonna stay here. Huh? I'm gonna stay here. It's too scary. Right. Didn't come from this area of the house, but it sounded like footsteps. Hold on, hold on, hold on. Oh shit, the door closed. Jesus Christ, the door just closed. Was there someone in? Hey, he sound kind of scared though. He sound kind of scared though. Didn't come from this area of the house, but it sounded like footsteps. Jesus Christ, the door just closed. Oh shit. Was there someone in? Did you see anyone? No. He going in there. Oh shit. Nothing is Guys, in anyone here? in here? I don't think so. No one behind the door. Hello? Hello? Mariño? Hello? There's no one in here. Bro, what? No way, bro. The door is really stiff on the carpet. So we can't close so well. Damn. There's no window open. Ethan moved up the curtains. Hell no. Nothing. Really dusty. Yeah, let's get out of here, guys. Come on. Yeah, quick, guys, quick, go, quick, go on. Quick. Go on. 300 years. A bedroom house. door at the end of the hallway on the second floor slams shut. Boom. They open the door to inspect the bedroom and no one there. Nobody. So could this family be dealing with a poltergeist? I leave it to you to Real decide. Real or fake? Real or fake on that one? That Before one. we move on to the next video, if you see anything that know. you think should be included in the top five, Contact us at nukestop5 at gmail.com. I don't know. A haunting visit. Real or fake, y'all? Kimberly Carlisle from Waynesboro, Mississippi received a motion detection update on her outdoor security camera. Okay. When she checked the footage, she found something truly creepy. Yo, what the fuck? Yo, what the fuck? What? The video quickly gained popularity. Many curious viewers commented that it looks like there's two or possibly three apparitions. Some even say that it's a lady wearing a dress from the 1900s, oh, shit. followed by her two ghostly children. Now, Kimberly and her husband William say that they have had their security camera in place for a long time, but they have never caught anything like this. I don't know about this one. So what do you think this is? Was it just a very odd fog rolling through the area? I don't know about and that And if one. so, why did they only get this one creepy notification? Hmm. The staircase. 
Paranormal investigators, Jeff. Y'all gotta let me know what y'all think about that one. I also drop with you if y'all still with me, man. Shout out to my real ones. Hit that like button if you just came in or if you haven't hit it yet. But I don't know about that last one, but let's go. Phil and Mark from the YouTube channel Ghost Tech Paranormal Investigations stay close to home in their new exploration as they spend the night at Phil's workplace in Kent, England. Okay. In 1902, the Kent Electric Power Company was built on the same land where Phil now works. Due to poor working conditions and a general disregard for worker safety, Damn. there were many horrific accidents. That's fucked up. Many workers lost their lives inside the old power plant, and it was eventually rebuilt in a new location. Damn. However, many believe that the ghosts of the old power plant workers still haunt the location. Phil says that through the years he's had multiple paranormal encounters while at work, but over that time he's just sort of gotten used to it. What? The Ghost Tech Paranormal Investigations team sets up Got several used? static cameras in the building to capture any supernatural activity. Then Jeff and Phil decide to ask questions directed at any residual spirits that might still haunt the building. They ask questions. And this is when things start to get really creepy. They asking questions. Hold on, y'all. Hold on. Shh, shh. We gotta listen. Shh, shh. We're about to start asking questions and shit. Can you walk somewhere on the staircase? That's what I was thinking. Can you walk up the stairs towards me, please? What? <laughs> Can you walk up the stairs? Don't worry about Jeff. Push past him. Oh, they playing. Don't worry about Jeff. Push past him. They really in here. Hold on, did you hear that? I thought someone was coming up the stairs. Uh-uh. Uh-uh. Did you As hear it? As we are hearing movement on the stairs, Phil asks for whoever it is to come up the stairs, and I hear footsteps approach me. Yo, that's Here is the enhanced audio. His voice sound creepy too. Hoodie up though. That shit sounded. I thought someone was coming up the stairs. The sound of footsteps can be heard coming towards Jeff as he's standing on the staircase. Cut to a little later into the investigation and the team decides to take a break upstairs. Shit. Right after they leave, a static camera pointed at the staircase captures something truly chilling Shit. what a shadow figure can be seen on the staircase which then vanishes as it walks to the side now yeah what do y'all think about that it should be noted here that the shadow what do y'all think about that what do y'all think what do y'all think let me know what y'all think because i don't know I don't know. Disappears right into a solid wall. So could it be that Phil's workplace is haunted by the ghosts of the deceased old power plant workers? I'll leave that up to you to decide. You can watch this entire investigation and many more spooky moments over on the YouTube channel. I don't know about that Ghost one. Tech Paranormal Investigation. But I definitely threw the hoodie up. Disappearing sure. act. For sure. Who is here? Whoa. Hold on. We got serious real quick. Come on. Matter. Popular Chinese Thanks. ghost hunter Xiao Long. Thank you for that donation. He said, when are you going on a ghost hunt? Oh, hell no. <laughs> sets out to investigate the creepy hell story no. surrounding an abandoned and allegedly haunted mansion in Fushun City, China. He broadcasts his exploration live on his YouTube channel and also on a Chinese broadcasting app. Okay, so he live. So you already know what that means. When you live, you can't really edit shit. This is live, so it's different. As thousands tune in to watch his live stream, as Xiaolong makes his way through the massive building, exploring the long hallways room by room, he suddenly hears he a very eerie sound. He a soldier for that. Look at that shit. Who's an audio? Where am I? Tuner. Be quiet. They say it's a coochie.
It's the coochie? <laughs> Hold on, is this the coochie? Don't tell me this the coochie and I missed it, yo. This ain't the coochie, is it? Oh, y'all playing. Oh, y'all playing. <laughs> y'all wildin'. <laughs> What's wrong, your mother? You said F your mother. Yeah. Who is it? Go down there. Big, you big and bad, you on live and shit. Go down there. Is it the sound from here? I don't know where the Xiao Long is. is shocked as he hears the creepy sound of a Gu Qin, an ancient Chinese musical instrument, being played by someone. But Xiaolong's night is about what to become fuck? much more terrifying. As he continues to explore, he finds himself lost in an endless maze of confusing hallways in the large abandoned mansion. What happens next is downright chilling. Hold on now. He in here solo on live. Getting no views. Why is this place so big? It's a mansion. Whoa now. Whoa now. Hold on now. Be careful. Hell no. He, he For him to be in there like that solo by himself. He hit a breathing. Be careful. Be careful. Hold on now. Hold on now. Oh, what the fuck? What's wrong, your mom? F your mom. Something down mm. there. Ooh. He said, no, my man said, ooh. No, my man didn't say, ooh. Are you? Ooh. <laughs> <laughs> what my man said, yo? Ooh. Oh shit. Hey, hit that like button, man. Hit that button, man. Said, oh, he did it again. He did it again. What's on you, Maya? What's that? What's on you? Oh, he ran towards it. Hey, y'all gotta spam ooh in the chat. <laughs> y'all gotta spam ooh in the chat, man. <laughs> Shit. Ah! Oh, ah! Bro, this happening on live, bro. Something by somebody down there, bro. This is quote unquote live now. Ah! Oh, is he running to it? Oh, hey, oh, 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 oh. Nothing down there. Oh shit. The door. Hey! Something close the door. Yo, this shit getting real, ain't it? Oh, oh. oh. Hey. Hey. Something close the door. Xiaolong is shocked as he sees an eerie shadow figure seemingly watching him from the end of the hall. Hell he charges nah. toward it only to find that it has disappeared and now reappears back where he started. What? He chases it. But again, it disappears into thin air. Real or fake, bro? Because I, I, how does it just disappear? In the distance, he sees a door unexplainably closed by itself. So Xiaolong thinks that the dark figure he saw might have ducked inside the room. Is he going so he room? heads toward the door to investigate. Oh, shit. <laughs> Damn this day, niggas is pussy for real. What's up? Pop off. Let's go. He said, look, I don't see you run behind that door. I'm about to go check it. He said, I'm about to go check it. And do you hear You hear his breathing. His breathing is crazy right now. Hit that like button, man. Hit that like button. Room. So he heads toward the door to investigate. Let's go. <laughs> listen. Listen. Hold up. Don't forget he on live, bro. He live right now. This ain't pre-recorded. 
My man said, ooh. Hold up. You hear the music again. What? You hear the music. Who is holding him on? F your mother. Listen. What? Uh -oh. Ah! oh, shit. The door slammed behind him? He locked in there? Ain't no way. He locked in there. Bro, ain't no way. He can't get out? Damn. And with that, Xiao Long has had enough. Hell yeah. He sprints along the winding halls of the mansion and eventually makes his escape. So did Xiao Long capture a strange teleporting shadow figure? As always. Yo, real or fake, guys. Real or fake. This was on a live stream. This was on a live stream. So y'all let me know what y'all I leave that to you to decide. You can watch many more of Xiao Long's terrifying explorations live on his YouTube channel, Outdoor Xiao Long. Damn. Stranger in the house. Shit. When TikTok user Leanne moved into her new house with her son and two daughters, she didn't know much about the property's history or previous owners. Okay. But as it turns out, a man had taken his own life in the house many years ago. What? Even stranger, the previous owners said that the house was haunted by that man's ghost and had left in fear. Hell so, nah. not long after Leanne and her family move into the house, odd unexplainable things begin to occur. One day, Leanne notices her six-year-old son, Dylan, exhibiting uh, some very odd behavior. Like I said, once you start dealing with kids and you deal with animals, that shit be, that shit different. That shit different, man. Here. See, look, what he got, why he gonna fake it? Is that Barney? Whoa. Little Dylan is playing with his toys in the living room when he can be heard saying, who's that? Uh, then Dylan seems to be looking at something that we can't see before quickly spinning around, seemingly frightened by something behind him. What the hell? Almost as if he felt something touch him. What the hell? And things just get creepier from here. One autumn day, Leanne is outside filming little Dylan as he plays in the fallen leaves. Then this happens. Uh oh. Yay! I don't see nothing. What happened? What are you looking at? Whoa! What? He looked at something and then he get pushed down? Whoa. Ain't no way that's fake. How is that even fake? Dylan happily throws around leaves and then he seems to throw his toy at something. Right. But then some unknown force seems to forcibly shove him to the ground. Yo. Leanne believes that the spirit that haunted their house was now targeting her six-year-old son. Soon after this video and several other incidents, Leanne and her family moved out. You got to. They had only lived in the house for seven months, but they Damn. no longer felt safe. So. Make sure y'all hit that like button, but you got to move. They did the right thing. They didn't stay around for longer for that. You got to get up out of You just pushed a little baby like that. <sighs> Let's go, man. Was Leanne's house? <laughs> Somebody said man got folded. Haunted by the former tenant? What do you think? The unwanted roommate. Popular paranormal investigator Chriselle Luna says that after eight years of exploring haunted places, that some strange dark presence seems to have attached itself to her and even followed her home. Hell no. Nah. At her new apartment in the Dominican Republic, she sets up multiple cameras around her home in hopes of capturing the strange paranormal activity that she experiences on a daily basis. And oh, it works. Late one night as Chriselle is sleeping in bed, her security camera catches something chilling. Oh shit. The pillow star vibrating? Bro, what the hell?
she sleeping with the light on too. She ain't playing with that shit. The picture is, is rotating? So the picture rotating on his arm? Oh. How do you even fake that? How do you even fake that though? Oh, and she woke up. That shit crooked. And she went back to sleep? <laughs> the shit went back? Is she sitting there looking at it? Eerily, a pillow at the end of Chriselle's bed begins to move, rocking back and forth on its own. That's weird. Then a painting on the wall just sort of slowly rotates. The sound of the painting scraping along the wall wakes Chriselle, but she's confused and has no idea where the strange sound might have come from. Cut to the next night. The next and Chriselle night. is woken again by strange sounds, but this time the bizarre noises are coming from her empty, dark bathroom oh, she grabs her phone and hits record what she captures is absolutely unnerving Leo during the next clip was mysteriously corrupted doesn't know why uh... Cause she moving around too much and when you move around too much shit can just get in the camera real quick you know what i mean when you moving the camera around shit, boom, you know what i'm saying so hit that like button let's go like figure can be seen moving around in Chriselle's bathroom what the fuck? but when she heads in to investigate there's nothing there so is Chriselle haunted by a dark presence they say she on an android just what is this let me know what you think you can watch Chriselle's entire video and many more creepy explorations hell over nah. on her YouTube channel Chriselle Luna hell nah watching you this next video hey that one was kind of creepy I ain't even gonna lie was sent in by Nuke's top five viewer Felix Estrella from Gainesville, Florida. One very early morning, Felix admits that he was a little inebriated when he went outside for some fresh air. He then spots something truly bizarre in a garage window. He pulls out his phone and starts to film. It's daytime, so that's always good. It's that night shit. What the fuck? What the f bro? Ain't no way this motherfucker gonna record that shit and say what the fuck, bro. Hold on, man. Let me get this story right. What? Watching you. This next video was sent in by Nuke's top five viewer Felix Estrella from Gainesville, Florida. One very early morning, Felix admits that he was a little inebriated when he went outside for some fresh air. He, was a little he then inebriated. spots something truly bizarre in a garage window. He pulls out his phone and starts to film. A little inebriated. Bro, look at this shit. Hell nah. Hell nah. Said what the fuck and just staring at the shit. Bro, what is going on? Okay, 
Okay, cool. Okay, cool. Okay, cool. He walking up to it. A pale, creepy face can be seen watching Felix from the window. As Felix walks closer to the garage, the face mysteriously disappears. I wouldn't walk up to this. So, could it be that Felix caught some kind of ghost or entity by accident? You tell me. Paranormal Nightmare. Uh oh, we made it to number one. We made it to number one. I need you to hit the like button if you haven't already, and I need you to drop with you in the chat for all my real ones. Drop with you in the chat. We made it to the number one. Oh man. If you with me, drop with you. Hit, hit the like button. Let's see what we got, man. <sighs> Let's see what we got. Let's go. For the last five years, Kathy Gallinger from the YouTube channel Paranormal Nightmares says she's been experiencing paranormal activity in her home in Canada. Now, Kathy might seem familiar as I've featured some of her spooky captures in her home before. Oddly, the paranormal presence often seems to target her pet cats. Oh shit, now we talking about cats. Now we talking, now we talking about cats. We seen this one, we seen this one. We dealing with animals now, it's gonna be different. Tripping, Kathy look. believes that the source of the haunting in her home might be her collection of antique dolls. However, Kathy doesn't want to get rid of the dolls as they belong to her aunt, who has now passed away. You gotta get rid of them. Kathy keeps the creepy dolls in the Hell basement no. with a security camera monitoring the area 24-7. I'm not gonna keep no dolls. I gotta monitor the area for them for any suspicious paranormal activity. You gotta get the fuck on. I'm not keeping this. These ain't even cute. So one day at around 3 p.m. in the afternoon, Kathy's husband, Jamie, goes into the basement to quickly cut a piece of wood in his basement workshop. Okay. When he comes back out, he's a bit freaked by what he sees. Chair tipping back. The whole chair tipping back. Perfect. Perfect. It's just sitting up like that. Bro, the chair is just sitting perfect like that. Oh, I know he about to trip. Look. Oh, shit. Look, look, look. Bro, did you see his reaction? He ain't even finished his step and he looked at it twice. Look. He walking do 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 Oh shit the fuck. He got quiet too. He ain't even breathe. He got quiet. So he was like, <laughs> it ain't frozen. I just did that. about to hit it yo what's up with my man hun he said hun hell nah that shit still sitting there like this oh shit hun uh -uh. The chair the dolls are in seems to lean back on its own and just stays there wobbling in mid-air. Jamie can't believe his eyes and uses the piece of wood he was cutting to just kind of poke around the chair, looking for anything weird. But he finds nothing, even after checking on all sides. That's crazy. The chair drops back to the floor and Jamie has had enough. That's crazy. He decides to just get out of there. 
But Jamie isn't the only one who has had a terrifying experience in the house. In the middle of the night, Kathy hears noises coming from the upstairs bathroom. Hell. She returns with her phone and begins to record in the dark. Oh, no. Before long, things take a terrifying turn. She up there. Guys, it's 2.30 in the morning. Hit the light. I'm in the upstairs bathroom. I was in here five minutes ago Hit the by light. myself. And I heard something whisper my name, so I ran into the bedroom and got my phone. I'm scared shitless. I'm in here by myself. Man, hit that like button. This lady is in the dark at 2.30 in the morning. All she got to do is hit the light. All she got to do is hit the light. I've got the night light on. I'm sitting on the toilet. I'm just waiting to see if I can catch the voice again. Let me back up. Oh, my God. What is that? Who are you? you? Oh, my God. Oh, my God. Go away. Stop it, man. What are we doing? I've got the night light on. I'm sitting on the toilet. I'm just waiting to see if I can catch the voice again. Who are you? Oh, my God. What is that? Who are you? Oh, my God. Oh, my God. Go away. Oh, oh, God. Kathy is shocked as she sees what looks like a strange misshapen shadow figure that seems what? to emerge right out of the darkness. I didn't even see that. She says she has no idea who or what it could be. So is Kathy's house haunted? Are the dolls haunted? Or is it all just an elaborate hoax? You decide. You can watch Kathy's videos over on her YouTube channel, Paranormal Nightmares. Thank you so much for watching. Oh man. Squad. Squad, squad, squad. We made it to the end. We made it to the end. Now, my hoodie did come up one time. But if you made it to the end, I need you to drop real one in the chat. Also hit that like button. Like I said, the merch just dropped. You know what I'm saying? Use the code SQUAD, you get 15% off everything in the store from now to the end of the year. Happy holidays to everybody. Shout out to my real ones though. Shout out to my real ones though, the people that made it to the end of the video. The people that made it to the end of the video. It was a couple creepy ones in there. Like I said, it was one of them that got me really shook a little bit. Had the hoodie come up. If you donated, definitely appreciate the super chats, man. I definitely appreciate the super chats. Uh, go on a ghost hunt, bro. I don't know about that one, man. I don't know about that one. But salute to all my real ones. Hopefully y'all taking care of y'all self, man. Make sure y'all hit that like button as well. Cop the merch and stay safe. <laughs> stay safe. Look at all my real ones in here. Shout out to all my real ones in here, man. Hey, look, and you watching the rebroadcast. Salute to you too, man. But till next time, self-love and positivity, Fire Squad, I got you. And you know it. That's a fact. Big bombs. <laughs>